hey guys welcome back in a new video and in this video we are going to know how to use sense and i'm going to explain you guys with the example so here's my unprocessed vocal track yeah let's go guys come on gotta change my answering machine now that i'm alone because right now that it says we can't come to the phone now look I want to add reverb 2 on my vocals but if I add reverb 2 in effects section of my vocal channel then it will apply to the entire vocals but I only want to add the reverb 2 effect on this part of my vocals. So in this case we use sense and now I'm going to add reverb 2 in sense to use it on the specific part that I want. So now it's also an important thing for you guys to know that we can create FX channel from here and also from here. Both are the same. So our FX channel is created and now we are going to link this FX channel to our vocal channel through Sense. So you see that how easily I connected the effect track channel with my vocal channel through Sense. And now I'm going to change the effect track channel name as Reverb2. And now add the Reverb2 on this effect track channel. Now create a clip on effect track channel where you want to add the reverb to effect like I want in this part as I said earlier. So as you can see I completed the automation for my reverb to effect on the effect track channel and now the reverb to effect will apply only on this part it will start from here and close here. Now one more important thing that maintain the length of your clip as per your automation ending point. Look how I do it. Now it's correct. The automation length and the clip length is same. And now make the level of the effect track to zero. And that's it. Let's see our sense working. Yeah, let's go guys. Come on. Gotta change my answering machine. Now that I'm alone. Cause right now that it says we. So guys, this is how you use sense in FL Studio Mobile. You can actually make more effect track and add different effects on them to use at any part of the track. And it, it doesn't mean that you can only use on vocal track. You can use it on piano, drums, any channel you created on FL Studio Mobile. As you can see, I added that same effect on the piano also. And now look how it's effect on the piano. Answering my scene. Now that I'm alone. So do you guys feel that after we connected the piano channel with effect channel through sense, the piano also get reverb at this part. So as you guys can see, I created one more effect track for my vocal. And you guys can also create effect track as much as you want and connect through sense. And guys, these buttons are to increase and decrease the amount of the effect. And the master button can control the level of both of this effect. Yeah, let's go guys. Come on. Gotta change my answering machine. Now that I'm alone. Right now that it says we can't come to the phone And I know it make no sense So what can we do baby?